Good morning, UPC kids. Welcome to Storytime. I'm glad you're here, and I'm Teacher Dave. The people of God had been traveling for many years in the desert. Their destination was the promised land by God. God had chosen a new leader for them, Joshua. They found when they got to the city of Jericho, it was a scary city with a lot of warriors inside, a lot of barriers and fortresses, and they were not welcome inside. They weren't quite sure what to do, but God knew what to do. God gave them a message. He gave Joshua the message to have them walk around the outside of the city fortress for seven days. They were a little confused about that. They were thinking, what's God thinking? Why don't we fight? Why do we have to march? We're not going to go anywhere. Well, they did. They marched around for those six days, and on the seventh day, they stopped because God had a new plan. The new plan was to make noise, to march around seven times the city in one day, and then make a lot of noise, all the noise that you could think of to make. They did. They marched around for those seven times, and they began to shout and holler and play. The priests played the trumpets. The people used their noisemakers. They did everything. They danced. They sang. They made extreme ear-splitting noise as much as you could ever imagine. The walls simply crumbled. They came crashing down. The whole city crumbled. Everything came down. God's plan worked. They trusted God. They didn't have to use their arrows. They didn't have to use their armor. They simply were able to walk through Jericho into their promised land. We may not always understand the plan that God has for us, but know that He's always there with us. He loves us. He has our back. He will take care of us no matter what our problem or our concerns or our worries are. Just like the people in this story. There was a period in my life where I wasn't sure of things. Where I had been sick, I had to have an operation, then I retired, then Pam and I moved from New York to Seattle to an apartment to be with our daughter. All of those things, I wasn't sure any of them were going to work. But uh, you know, they did. We prayed, we trusted God, and it worked out fine. We came to UPC. I'm doing Sunday school, have for 12 years, and what a blessing it's been for us. Jesus was chosen by God to be our perfect leader, a leader who one day will take us to our forever home in heaven, a home that no one can take from us. The great rescue plan is still working. Today's story can be found in the Jesus Storybook Bible, Joshua 3 and 6. There are other resources on our website, upc.org slash kids. There's also a video every week of the story we do. Let's pray. Dear God, we just give thanks for the time that we've had to share together with you. Help us listen, help us understand, and help us love the importance of trusting God, no matter what our circumstances are. Amen. Thank you, and it's been a pleasure this morning, kids. Hope to see you next week. Bye.